Because the most beautiful thing about you is that I met you, I think, when I was, what, 20, maybe, and you, I went to all these drum bass gigs, and you were getting up. Charlotte's a raver. <laughs> and now you've won Best Electronic Artist at the Vodafone New Zealand Music Awards. How are you feeling? I'm stoked. I feel so overwhelmed, and, like, um, I've waited a really long time. <sighs> I'm getting emotional again and um, I just the crowd was so nice they listened to me prattle on <laughs> and were really supportive and, and yeah I just I feel really grateful right now really grateful can you not necessarily rephrase but tell me what you spoke about because we were all watching the TV so intently what were you saying um, I was just saying how um, I'm I've been in this industry for 18 years and I guess a lot of people know me as like the first lady of New Zealand drum and bass, but I'm still pretty much the only lady. And I was just saying that, you know, that there is a place for women in drum and bass. Our scene is amazing. It's really welcoming and wonderful. And, and I, the promoters and the other DJs are so wonderful. And they want more sisters as well, and I definitely do. Um, so I was kind of just talking about that, but I was also saying um, how... Drum and bass is actually really loved in this country, even if people don't even know what it is they're listening to. So I just tried to give a few examples, you know, the All Blacks running out on the field to a shapeshifter tune and that kind of thing. So, um, yeah, just so that people weren't like, who the hell is this girl? <laughs> <laughs> Drum and bass feels like it still is underground, but hopefully by you winning this award and that speech, you'll take it bigger. I mean, I would hope so. I, I actually had this whole thing in my speech where I wanted to say about how, you know, drum and bass is so massive in this country and so massive abroad and we really deserve more than just a few niche radio stations playing us. You know, like I said, people actually love drum and bass. My parents love it, you know, my sisters and, and brothers love sister and brothers love it. And you know, they're not particularly into dance music, but it really is like accessible and it is a, a music that people can you know, there's different genres within the genre. So people can find what it is they love and I don't know if I'm helping to kind of bring publicity to that then awesome like I said I hope people will go home tonight and maybe look it up <laughs> what are you working on at the moment I have just finished touring America last week so I'm a little tired still um, so I've been touring pretty much all year um, and then I've got the summer festivals coming up and then next year I'm gonna have a little downtime and get back in the studio and start working on the next project <laughs> this is really a true validation though of all really your hard is. work <laughs> It really oh, is. It really is. I feel emotional you getting it. It's really beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, babe. Oh, oh, really deserve it. Thank you. Yeah. Bye.